This is Bob. Bob's an average web user. Bob finds he can easily remember a username and password for a single website. But keeping track of usernames and passwords for as many as 25 different websites is really hard. It's a huge problem for Bob to keep track of so many strong and unique passwords. Therefore, it shouldn't be surprising that, like Bob, the average internet user has at most five or six passwords, which creates a huge security risk for Bob if one of those passwords gets stolen, because then all the passwords for all the other sites become compromised also. Keeping all these passwords safely stored online is proving impossible, with companies and websites falling victim to password hacking. In 2011, Sony alone lost an enormous 77 million user passwords. The cost of stolen passwords to business is immense, with the average cost per breach amounting to $5.4 million. The cost to regular users is also high, with a total of 21 billion being lost by over 12 million US citizens in 2012. That's an average of over $1,600 per victim. Today, password systems work by having the user send their password to a server over a secure connection. The password is then either stored on the server using one-way encryption, or compared with an existing encrypted password in order to be verified. In the event a malicious attacker compromises the security of the connection between the client and server, the user's password and other credentials can be obtained simply by listening to the connection via a man-in-the-middle attack. An attacker also might compromise the server storing the encrypted passwords. Increasingly, the encryption of stored passwords is becoming easier to break. The Trust Inside system is different. The key difference is that the user's password never leaves the user's browser. Instead, the Trust Inside server tries to determine if the user knows the correct password using a zero-knowledge proof algorithm. When the user attempts to authenticate themselves on the server, the server generates a series of challenges and sends them to the user's browser. Software in the user's browser attempts to correctly complete the tests based on its knowledge of the password entered by the user. The challenges cannot be consistently completed correctly without knowledge of the correct password. At the same time, the responses do not contain any data that can be used to deduce the attempted password. If the Trust Inside service finds that all the responses are correct, then it can infer that the user must know the correct password. The exact methodology of this system is covered by a recently awarded US patent. This method is immune to many common forms of attack. In the event that an attacker manages to compromise the connection between the user and the Trust Inside service, there's no risk to the actual password as only tests and test answers pass through the connection, from which it's impossible to deduce the password. An attacker also cannot fool the system by recording these tests and replaying them later as the tests sent by the service to the user are randomized. Even in the event that an attacker compromises the Trust Inside servers, it's impossible to use the data stored on the service to recover the original passwords. Trust Inside can be added to existing systems requiring authentication as a trusted third-party service. The authentication process in this case begins with a token being created on the server looking for user verification. The token is sent to the user's web browser as embedded HTML in a web page. The user types in their credentials and begins verifying themselves with the Trust Inside service. This is done using the previously identified processes. If the user's credentials are verified, then the token will be accepted by the Trust Inside server. The server that originally created the token is then sent the same token by the Trust Inside service. If the server confirms that the token it sent to the user matches the one received from the Trust Inside service, then the user is verified. If you'd like to learn more about the Trust Inside service, please contact us. The details are on the screen. Thank you for watching.